So my name is Rita and I'm from Portugal. And about two years ago, I did the Eco Village Design Education course here in the Fintorn community with Jorge, who's right here next to me. And while I was doing this course, I was noticing how that was affecting my life so much and I could see how much I love this course. And then there was a dream during the course and I thought, I want to share the Eco Village Design course in one of my favorite places on Earth, the Azores Islands. These islands are part of Portugal and they're a place of this natural beauty that is just, um, I could just feel how it's like the perfect place to hold an eco-village design education course because the islands are actually very sustainable. People live in community, so um, a lot of the things that we are trying to convey with the eco-village design course, they are already present there, just naturally. And we want to show you Oh, so as Jorge reminded me, this is a course that is certified by Gaia Education and it's organized by Olhos Verdes Association, which is a, a young Portuguese non-profit dedicated to, to creating eco-village design courses around the world. And then it starts on the 15th of August this summer and it's a five-week program where we're all going to be living together in community for five weeks. And it will happen in this beautiful place called Sanguinho, which is um, a village that used to be abandoned and it's now being recovered. So all the houses are being redone and there is a community that wants to start living there. This is where we are going to be living for five weeks. And this place is in the middle of the um, São Miguel Island, which is in the middle of the Atlantic. And um, if you can see right there, it's really out in the middle of the Atlantic. So the air is very pure. The, um, the stars are just incredibly bright in the sky at night. And um, the air that you breathe in is just absolutely pure. And the whales, um, the whales, they travel the long distances of the Atlantic Ocean and they choose to go back to the Azores every year to mate. So it's part of their migratory route and they choose to meet in these very special islands and they inspire us also to acknowledge our migratory movements and to honor places that we always go back to. Okay, so yeah, very fast because I just saw that we just have one minute. I'm going to introduce quickly the team. We're part of the team here, but there are some people that is not here. So we are Rita, Thaisa, me, Felipe, Ina, Mari, Inez, Gabi, Anna, Shami, Philippa, and Ethan. And I'm going to uh, give some very sort of briefly some highlights of the course. Like there is a very practical approach, designing a real eco village on site. Interaction with local community, experience interchange. Uh, there's an international team. Uh, you can, well, you know many of us. We are working towards gift economy, helping everyone to be able to participate whatever the circumstances are. We are creating sustainability. We are a nomadic community as the whales that comes here to the Azores to meet. And the we, just, we are just launching a crowdfunding campaign and uh, we will uh, ask you to, if you can support us and we, are, we will be very grateful. We are just launching it uh, maybe tomorrow. So and, uh, this is our website where you can, you can find all the, all the information about the course. And I'm going to pass the microphone very quickly to... Felipe. Okay, very, very fast just to to say that we are really grateful and honored to invite all of you to join us. And we feel that it's not just as the team or the people inviting to come and join to this place and to this eco-village design education, but it's all the elements that are in the place. It's all the landscape, it's all the fertile so soil that wants to be born from this uh, uh, design. So please come and join and we are very, very happy to welcome you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Wow. Thank you. Wow. <laughs>